Tonight, monkeypox cases are exploding coast to coast as health officers in New York State and San Francisco have declared a health emergency as the country faces a shortage of vaccines. We have received uh, just about 12,000 doses. About 4,000 of those came just in the past few days. Dr. So Susan Phillips, San Francisco top doctor, says the city needs about 70,000 doses to get a handle on the outbreak. They're calling on the federal government to ramp up vaccines, testing and treatment. And right now, who is eligible to receive a vaccine? We are really prioritizing limited vaccine to the populations that are most impacted. So that is including gay men, bisexual men, other men who have sex with men. Multiple cities are seeing long lines for vaccines. I've been waiting for four hours, <laughs> four hours. As demand continues to outpace supply, a growing number of states and cities are prioritizing a single dose of the two-dose Genios vaccine, despite warnings from both the FDA and CDC that both doses are needed. They're in such excruciating pain that the emergency department is the first place that they come. Dr. Virat Medea is on the front lines as an ER doctor in New York City, which has seen more than 1,200 cases. And the patients that I'm seeing are suffering uh, from pain, but then for weeks afterwards, and sometimes even longer than that. Yes, this is a public health emergency. This is something that we need to have all hands on deck. Starting today, more than 780,000 additional monkeypox vaccines are being distributed to states as the Biden administration comes under growing pressure to follow the lead of the WHO and declare monkeypox a national health emergency something the White House says it is still considering.